We all know what exploding or explosion means, right? When something is said to have exploded, it basically means that the object bursted outward due to pressure from the inside. Well, implosion is simply the opposite of this. If something is said to have imploded, it means that the object has collapsed inwards due to pressure from the outside. Therefore, a submersible like OceanGate Expedition's Titan is said to have imploded if it collapses inwards on itself due to the high pressure of the water. Deep diving submersibles and submarines are built to withstand this extreme pressure but any damage to the body of the vessel that can cause a leak will always result in implosion and we believe that the Titan either missed necessary safety features to prevent it from the catastrophe or was damaged in its downward descent leading to the implosion that killed all its five occupants. You know, I've broken some rules to make this. I think I've broken them with, with logic and good engineering behind me. The carbon fiber and titanium, there's a rule you don't do that. Well, I did. Even though the Titan submersible was estimated to have imploded at around 1,600 feet from the floor of the Titanic, the immense water pressure must have crushed the submersible in an instant, exploding the vessel and sadly killing everyone on board very quickly. As a result, the bodies of those aboard the submersible couldn't be recovered from the wreckage because they were torn apart and then subsequently eaten by marine creatures inhabiting the dark waters.